All right, so we thought we'd take you through a little video tour. All right, so we've got kind of that Berber carpet throughout the house. One of the closets has an updated carpet, it must have had some stains on it. You have the faux wood blinds throughout. Um, one thing we notice is this is tile, so you have the grout on the countertops, unfortunately, but you have uppers. Upper cabinets, which is rad and not always something that's, um, you know, uh, a common, um, the word escapes me, but it's not a common thing, um, standard, right? And then you have a nice little pantry in the corner here. Dishwashers on this side. You have a black 6040 sink. This lot is about a quarter of an acre, just shy of 12,000 square feet. So you have an enormous backyard, all the trees, all the plants, built-in kitchen over here. Um, pool needs some love. You got pavers. They've got holes drilled for a fence. So yeah, it might even be here. We'd have to look for it. But um, again, huge lot. You've got the pool equipment over here. AC units look a little older. This house was built in 02. Those might even be original. So we're looking at 20 year old AC units. Could be time for the replacement ones. Um, okay, so this is all faux grass. So there's some thick grass. I always add a gate over here, so long as HOA approves it. Sun shades, that keeps a lot of that sun out. Um, and those can be obviously removed. Um, we have a full bed and bath down here. Washer dryer area. Right. Um, utility sink on the left here. Three car garage with your heating element. Um, soft water huge water heater, some built-ins, three-car garage. Let's go take a look back in the living room really quick because I kind of skipped over this living room and your spare bedroom downstairs. We have full bath downstairs, bedroom with walk-in closet. The windows are starting to experience a little bit of a seal popping, which just adds some moisture in between the panes, causing moisture inside the panes and foggy windows, ultimately. Um, let's take a look upstairs. Nice little platform that ultimately would be used as a jumping off point or <laughs> be a great spot for some decorations. All right, over here to the left, we have our full bath with two sinks. Uh, bedroom through two through yeah two and then three this is a den but also qualifies as a bedroom that's a new rule I was just telling uh, Mike about it we have a private deck looking at the mountains if you trim back your tree there you'd actually be able to see them a little bit better from your bedroom but this is the primary suite Huge double doors into, excuse me, your bathroom where you have sinks, dual sinks in here, which are separate into your walk-in closet, which has built-ins. And actually, I don't think the light's working well. Yeah, it is. So you have some built-in cabinetry here, which is nice. Keep things organized or attempt to, right? Anyway, so that's pretty much the house. I'll get you a shot of the front yard at the beginning of the video. I'm sure you'll see that, so.